The good old artifact system. A system that is purely run on RNG. In a game that gotcha is the main genre of the game, which is also RNG, and then the drops of the game also are RNG, and then the weapons you pull are RNG. Everything in this game is RNG, and artifacts, I feel like, is the most relatable one, because literally everyone deals with it every single day. Now, the best artifacts for Yai Miko. Now, what are they? Well, couldn't I just say it's RNG, because it depends on what drops you got, what artifacts you get, what stats you get, the math that adds up to it, all of it. I could literally just say it's RNG, as long as it makes sense. You can't put Crimson Witch on you, I, I mean, I guess you somewhat could, but... Anyways, that is the reason why I believe artifacts on Yamiko very, 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 very. It varies to person to person because I don't know your artifacts and what your Yamiko has and what's her talents, what's your situation, what do you need her to do, blah blah blah. It adds, it keeps going. So I feel like as long as you know somewhat what you're doing, artifacts on Yamiko are pretty simple. But the thing you should realize is you should play Yamiko the way you want to play your Yamiko. Do you want to play her with your E, her burst? or even her charge attack, it all depends on that, and go what you like. Go what you like for sure. It's This game is definitely for fun, and depending on what you want on her, you can go whatever you want. It literally doesn't matter. But, here's the key though. I do feel like there is a ma artifact set that everyone should run for. Now, it is the new one. War Peace Gilded Dreams. There's a multiple reasons why I really like this artifact set on Yamiko. It's very long, but here. Basically, it gives attack and EM for Yamiko, which both benefit her in both abilities that she wants. Her E is elemental mastery buffed, and her burst is attack buff. As you can hopefully understand, she can use both stats, which is very, very nice because you can overall b boost the damage of her E and her burst. Unfortunately, I can't even tell- I can't even prove to you what what set is the best for her because I don't have anything. I have not- I have no real say in what's the best. As long as you have Electro, two-piece Electro, two-piece anything, attack, two-piece EM, four-piece Electro, all of it is solid. I cannot show you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry if I like clickbaited you into this video, but I can't show you what it really is. It's just the reality of artifacts, man. I want to. I want to be have the best and strongest Yamiko, but uh, only really, only really whales can have stronger pieces. Maybe that's one of the reasons why the artifact system is so hard that you're gonna want to swipe for it. Maybe that's the argument Mahoyo has. But I hate that <laughs> That argument sucks. I feel like artifacts should be something everyone can do. If I do have to trust myself and my gut feeling, if you have a so if you have very high rolled four piece gilded dream salt set, it is probably the best set on Yai. Just because it makes sense. You want attack, you want EM, and that set provides a good amount of attack and EM. More than I think what the other sets give. So always So I think if you want to true if if you want to invest a resin into an artifact set that is the best for her while you're running temporary artifacts like me that's probably the best way to go just farm guild set gilded dreams maybe you can use it as it's your two piece also right two piece upgrades and uh yeah just try to find the best artifact set for you amigo and there is a ton of I will tell you that there is a lot of comparison videos on YouTube, so I'm gonna link some that I think that I've watched and I think I can help prove you because I didn't prove anything to you. I'm just talking. I'm just talking and saying that Gilded Dream is the best. But I I have a strong feeling that Gilded Dreams and I watch of course I watch a few videos, but I don't have the actual data to tell you what is actually the best. Just to prove it to you how crazy artifacts can be, 
I have been playing Genshin Impact for two years. Here, let me prove it to you. I've been playing this game for two years. As you can see here, Amber joined on October 1st, 2020. It's about a week until then. And the only good Electro pieces I have on my eye, Miko, which is a set that has been from the very beginning of the game, is this flower. I mean, it's not bad. It's definitely a solid piece, but like, come on, where is the crit? This is also a decent piece, not bad, but where do you guys think this, these pieces come from? Hmm? Hum? Oh no, not the domain itself, the strong box. Yes, it came from strong box. That's why artifacts are a scab. Here, I made feathers. Oh, look at this piece. I mean, it's not bad, but why is their HP and defense both have one hit? This piece is not bad, but does it make me do more damage on my Amico? This piece is just literally the same thing. What the hell is this defense ER? And then this was, oh my God. This was the feather I've been using on my Yai Miko when she was first released. It was so sad. I was crying. The f I was, I was so mad. I was farming Thundering Hearing for so long, but this was the feather I had to stick with for like over four months until I found one of these. And then now I'm rolling strong box because it's in the strong box. And now this is my greatest piece. By the way, I I want to main this character. This character, this character right here, he's my maid. I've been farming for her for so long. To be fair, I do get f sidetracked with what I farm. Like, I mean, yeah, but come on, I've been maining this character for artifacts, and I haven't been able to get legit upgrades from the domain. Maybe I should just try more. Maybe. Not to mention, I don't even have a usable timepiece. There's- I literally have none. All of them? Yeah, this is- this is my locked timepiece. This is the only locked timepiece I have. Oh, defense, defense, attack. Oh, wow. So good. Right, I mean, don't have to complain about the goblet, but... I mean... <laughs> this is my locked crown, yeah? I mean, I- I could use this. This could be my Yamiko's crown in the past before Sumeru. Yeah, sure. Sure, Royal. Look at all these crowns I have. Whoa, they're all utterly garbage. Oh, double line. This, this, this should be illegal. I'm a Yai maid. And I can't even get a good Electra set for her. Just to have some sort of that to set it just for like for fun set. Like I don't think Thundering Fury does the most damage, but like come like at least have the artifacts to like try it, you know? I don't even have that. That's why I hate artifacts. Artifacts are just dumb. That's why that's one of the reasons why I'm hoarding so much. So hoarding so many books. Hoarding so much Mora, hoarding so much Weapon enhancement or because artifacts suck to farb. You're not getting legit stuff. Sometimes your resin is just being burned. I mean, I guess the argument is you're trying to get an upgrade. But you can literally just get be unlucky forever. And I think that's what happened to me. Maybe I'm just unlucky. Maybe I suck. Maybe I suck. Maybe it's a skill issue. Maybe I actually do suck at this game, but... I mean, as you can see, sometimes it's just not it, you know? But anyways, yeah, doing all DR. Try to aim for four piece Guild of Dreams, but if you don't have any, it doesn't matter. I th I don't think it makes that much a difference. Of course, it makes a difference, but not so much that you're like missing out on. Mo what the hell was that cat? Okay. <laughs> but anyways. Where was I? <laughs> that just fell out of the air. Um, but yeah, go for four pieces of Vigil of Dreams if you can. Don't worry if you're missing it. And yeah, I think it gives the most buffs. I will link videos right now. Want to check them out? That I think are good.
to watch. And yeah, I hope you guys get good artifacts. Why did it start raining, man? What the hell is this? Okay, raining Andy then. <laughs> Rainy Andy then. Rainy ending then. Oh my god. But yes, that's the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys you guys learned something. Maybe you didn't, but yeah. Arm bank sets are hard, so good luck and I hope you have a good rest of your day. Bye guys. <laughs>